Monday is International Day of the Girl, a day to highlight and address the needs and challenges young girls face while also promoting female empowerment. And we've all heard of history, but here's an event focused on her story. Beauty for Freedom will work to raise money for organizations founded and led by women of color from the United States and from Africa. Monica Watkins is the executive director of Beauty for Freedom and joins us this morning. Monica, the mission of your organization is, like we said, to promote female empowerment, especially for young girls. So how does this live stream event that you're hosting, Her Story, play a role in that? Absolutely. Well, the organizations that we're working with actually support the empowerment, education, and, you know, fulfillment of that promise of supporting the livelihoods of women and girl, all, girls all over the world. So it's a live stream event that's a fundraiser for four different organizations that work specifically in areas uh, that are underserved where girls and women uh, are not supported. And so this is a way for us to raise funds for those organizations and actually tell their stories in the process. And talk a little bit more about the programs. I mean, how can these young girls participate in these programs to receive some of those benefits? And also, why is this cause so important? The women and girls that will benefit from the funds that are raised through these organizations are actually supported. So, for example, uh, our organization, Beauty for Freedom, is an anti-trafficking organization. We've been able to serve multiple communities in India, West Africa, Southeast Asia, uh, and right here in the United States. So, through our programming, uh, and through this fundraiser, we'll be able to support more women and girls who are survivors of uh, sex trafficking and labor trafficking through this program. You know, we're raising $10,000 for each organization. And for example, the organization in Malawi has a school that is uh, donating, you know, education and skills training to women and girls right there in Malawi. And they'll be able to support more through the COVID crisis. Uh, many grassroots organizations have lost a lot of funding for many of their programs. Uh, they're, they're not able to reach as many communities as they have been previously. In South Sudan, the organization that we're working with actually had to close down their school. So this funding would be able to help them to open their school again so that these young girls and young women can continue their educations. A much needed funding, like you said, for a much needed mission and cause. If you want more details about International Day of the Girl and the Her Story live streaming fundraising event, just look for the Philly Live section of NBC10.com or the NBC10 app. And Monica Watkins, thank you so much for joining us this morning on Philly Live. It was so nice chatting with you.